first sprint is going to happen at 2.2 kilometers. It is coming, um, actually at 2.6, I do apologize. It is coming right after a 4% um, descent. So it's going to be exceptionally fast. So you have 30 seconds to go, um, get ready. I will call up the sprint. One thing that I need you to be on the lookout for Heads up that I'm actually here, thanks. Nice, Jimmy, good work. Good work. Uh, at two kilometer, at two kilometer distance, you need to follow the attacks. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Spin up, spin up, spin up. Three, yeah, two, one. You should be going now. All righty, yep. Jimmy. I need cool, you to guys. stay with the front group. That's good, Jimmy. Keep stay with them, stay with them, but don't lead. Stay with them. That's good. That's good. Good effort. Good effort. Daryl, follow it through. Follow it through. Jimmy, I need you to pull back just a little bit. I want you to stay with that group, but I don't want you to lead them out. Keeping in mind that I don't have the distances for you yet, I will not have them for 1 minute and 15 more seconds. So please let me know when you approach about 1.5 or thereabout. I do have a feather. You do have a feather. Um, okay, feather yeah. is kind of useless here. Um, but let's do, uh, does anyone have a um, burrito or what, what is the third one that we have? Anvil. Burrito. Okay, if you have a burrito, um, wait until just before the sprint and drop it there. And by the way, you're just about to pass me on the road facing the opposite direction. This is kind of weird. But okay, fair enough. I still can't see your um, distance and position. We are 1k in. About. Okay, sounds good. I should be able to see your positions in about three seconds. Um, so I can see see you now. So you are climbing up there right now. It's going to be slightly uphill. Just keep your effort. Stay with the front group. You don't want to drop too much behind. Daryl, if you can move toward the front, that would be great, but don't go in front. Jeff, just stay there where you are. Follow that guy in the orange. Follow that guy in in a camo jersey. Just stay with them. This is 7%. It's going to kick up, but not much. I need you to be careful to not lead. Now, maintain speed on the way down. This is now rolling terrain. Nothing is going to happen for about 400 more meters. Then there it will be an attack, and I need you to be ready to follow. That will be 200 meters at about 4%. This is not it, but just stay with the front, go with the front group, go with the front group, don't fall back. This is not it, I don't want you to lead anything here, just be ready. Watch out for the guy with the anvil, he is not going to have fun time now. Now this is where the kick is, I need you to follow all the attacks that happen here, go, 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 go. I don't want you to lead this attack, but I need you to be toward the front. Daryl, do you have anything in you? Are you here for the sprint? No. Well, yes. That's what I meant. Maybe. Keep going, keep going. There is an attack up front. I need you to cover that. I need you up front. Number two, number three. Keep going, Jimmy. Jimmy, you need to speed this up. This is it. This is it. Keep going. Now, hit it. Oh, wonderful with it. With the anvil, go, 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 go. Full power, full power now, full power. This is it, this is the descent. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Stronger, 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 stronger. This is it, keep going, keep going, Jimmy. Faster, 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 faster. Outstanding job there. You are, I think, number four or number five. Now, stay with the front group, try to recover a little bit. 
Everyone else, try to catch up, try to catch up. Jimmy, I don't want you up front. I need you toward the front, but not to Stay back, stay back. Go away from the burrito. Go away from the burrito. Pull back, pull back. Pull back. Let them go with the burrito. There's nothing they can do here now. All right, now catch up with them. Daryl, you are back in the fold. Everyone else? All right, um, so next event of note, um, you are going to have at about 4.9K, actually at 3.7 right here, you are going to have a little bit up to 6%. So make sure to stay with the group. If you have a feather, you may want to consider using it or keeping it for the client. Whatever you need to rest. I can see more folks in the back. Jimmy, if you can uh, put a little bit more effort there with Shalom. Catch up with the Shalom there in front. There are two of you. Just push a little harder. You are right behind the main group. But I don't want you at the tail end of that group. A little bit more. A little bit more there. Whoever is behind two pink trons, I can't see your name. Just push a little more. I don't. This is not where I want you to be. Harder, harder. Go into the middle of that group. Perfect. That's it. This is what I want. Now, this burrito hurts you a little bit, but that's okay. Uh, not in front. Okay, outstanding job, boys. So keep in mind, at 4.9, this is going to start climbing a little bit, not much. You will have super tackable descent. Yeah, this is the start of the reverse. Let's do it that's a steep for a turn, and then we turn off to the left. Nice. It looks like the group is down to 43. So. Down, to 40, down to 43 out of 57, that's good. The, the group has split a little bit. Uh, the good news is that all six of you are in the front group, so this is what I like to see, and that's good job. So this is where it gets difficult. This is where it's going to get difficult. This is not a scored climb. No need to push a hero, heroic efforts. Just stay with the group. There are no points to win here. Don't lead. Don't lead. It goes up to it goes up to ten percent. Correct. At 5.7, it's going to pitch down, so be ready for that. You're at 5.4. This is where it gets difficult. It goes to 10%, so stay with it. Stay with the group. Three of you are on the back. Paul G, I need you to push. Jimmy, I need you to push. Jeff, I need you to push. I don't want you last here, because when the descent starts, you will not be able to catch up. Yeah, I need effort from all three of you. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Paul, Jimmy, effort. You need to stay with that group, otherwise you will be dropped. <laughs> Jimmy, this is critical now. I need full power from you right now. Keep going, get to 57 and tuck in. <laughs> stronger effort, boys, stronger effort. You, the, the front group is splitting. You need to catch with them. This is where, th this is no time for slacking now. <laughs> Matt, I need effort. Okay, Jimmy, j pull back, pull back. This is it, you are in front of the group. I don't want you to lead them. But speed up, go to 57, 58. Get to super tech speed and relax. This is it, this is it, follow the group. Fall back, fall back into the group and stop pedaling. Oh, stop pedaling now. Stop pedaling now. This is it. Relax. Don't pedal. Don't pedal. Just super tuck all the way down. 
Jimmy, you need to pedal a little bit here. Perfect. This is oh, your so cool. the group. So cool. <laughs> Matt, Paul, Jimmy, you are behind. The group has dropped you. Um, if you work with the people who are around you, you may be able to catch up, but it will require an effort. Don't lead, don't lead. Jeff, I, I don't want you up front. I am strict about that. So the next thing of, of, to note will be at 11.9, where the Titans Grove reverse KQM starts. It's a 900 meter climb. It goes from 11.9 to 12.8. Up until then, there will be an attack point at 9.7. So I need you to be ready to cover those attacks. The group behind you still can catch them. It is iffy at best, but it is not undoable. Hey guys, you can if, you need to, if you need to front that group, do it. I'm not quite sure whether you are in it. I can't really tell. It's not easy for me to tell that. Hey, Jimmy, let's first the further. Yes, Jimmy, you are you are in there. So work, work there, work there. You you have almost bridged a yeah, little you bit harder, that. Jimmy. I, yeah, got right, I need you to work. Follow the blue guy. Follow the blue guy. Try to go in front of him if you have power. Catch up with Paul G, and you have you have bridged the gap. And uh, uh, you need more effort. This guy is not pulling. You need to go in front. You need to make this effort, Jimmy. Come on, here, I'll even give you a ride on. Come on. A little bit more, a little bit more. You're almost there. But you need those 10 more seconds of effort. There it is. Go into the middle of. Okay, that's it. That's it. Well, well done. Well done. Well done. Good job, Jimmy. Nice work. Well done. So this is it. Now the job is to stay with this group. The best place to be would be somewhere toward the middle front, not in front, Jeff. Enjoy the scenery, relax, get some coffee, drink some water, get some hydration going. If you have something to chew on, now is the time to do it. Deep breaths. This is rolling terrain, so no really time to fully rest, but you can recover. It's going to pitch up now. It goes to about 6%, but not more than that. Well done. Just stay with the group. You're doing fine. So I'm counting five of you up front. We have dropped someone. I don't know who. Matt. Matt, OK. No, Mantlin, don't worry about me. OK, how far behind are you? 20 seconds. Uh, I. OK, let me take a look at you. I try to make up time on the KOM, but I'm just too worried right now. So there is a guy 11 seconds behind you. Um, you're 40 seconds. Um, working with him will be easier. So if you want to ease off and work with him, it will make no difference points wise. Um, so take it easy until he catches you and then work with him. Um, the next person ahead of you is seven seconds ahead. Uh, chasing him solo makes no sense. Uh, chase him with that other guy and you will catch up. 
So you will move as a group of three, but points wise, it makes no difference. So no, it's better to work as a group of three. Is your attack point, Marco? Uh, attack point is at 9.7. Nine yeah. No attack. No attack. Okay, thanks. Ready to save it. That's good. That's good. Nobody, nobody is playing a hero, which is good. Which means at 11.9, it's going to be slightly harder climb because nobody tried to make up time here. Again, you have rolling terrain there. It's going to go up to 8%. I think it doesn't go above that. So right now you're approaching the point at about 10.3 where there could be heroes, so watch out for them. And Jeff, I need you to not fall that much back. Same goes for Paul. Some people are already dropping from this group, but I don't want you to be them. a little bit movement up front not much but this looks like they are going to go so follow them Daryl you are the closest try to bridge that just shut it down this is it this is it this is good OTR did it for you OTR did it for you good Good. Now you have a descent. Try to try to get some speed. Try to get some some uh, some rest because the climb is about to start. It's at eleven point nine. You need to go out of super tuck now. You can go back in a few seconds, but not yet. This is it, you can super tuck here if you have speed, which most of you don't, so just keep going with this rolling terrain. The group is still very compact, there is a little bit movement up front, so I need to cover that. They are obviously going for the FTS points. I just need you to not be last, Paul. Okay, keep going. Boys, this is 900 meters, let's go. If you have a feather, uh, you can use it at any time. This goes to about 8% max, if I remember well. If you have an anvil, uh, don't use it. Jeff, I need you to speed that up a little bit if you can. Hey guys. Oh, my God. Uh, Shalom, if you can make a little bit of an effort, the front group is moving away. I need you to stay with that yellow Tron, catch up with the blue Tron ahead of you, and then try to bridge towards the front group. Daryl, I need more effort from you here. You're number 12. You are in the race. You're number 13. Keep going. Keep going. You're number 12. Oh, outstanding job there. Keep going. You have 
up until 12.8. Now I need effort from you. You need to you need to beat two people here. You are going to get it, but you need more effort now. Now, now, more, 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 more. This is it. This is it. A little bit more. A little bit more. This is the line. This is the line. This is very good. Very good. Outstanding work, Daryl. Your number ten. Eyes. All right, Shalom. I need more effort from you to try to bridge because this is now stretched out like a noodle. Seriously, there is no front group. It has completely shattered. Daryl, I need you to stay with those three orange dudes. Work with them because they are obviously working to bridge the gap. You are in the game to bridge towards the, the front group. But you need to stay with them. And if you have it, lead them toward the next group. If you have Anvil, drop it. <coughs> if you have a burrito, don't do don't use it yet, Daryl. Okay. But keep keep working with these boys. Keep working with these boys. I'm going to give them write-ons just to make sure that they have an idea that I want them to work with you. Buddy, I'm coming up behind you. Maybe we can work together. Oh, what is this dude doing with the burrito? Damn it. Okay, uh, Daryl, follow the guy in blue. Follow the guy in blue. He he is working. He yeah. is working. He is he is stupid too, but And by stupid I mean Ray stupid, please don't comment on this uh, video stream. By stupid I mean he dropped a burrito when he actually for people to work with him, and that's really not how you encourage other people to work with you. I did that last week. <sighs> well, I yes, movie, I movie, move. Too. <sighs> Jeez, I right, so Daryl, Daryl, I need more effort for you. So this is now a group of top twelve, right? So this is a race. For you. Right. you are. It's the three orange guys here. I'm going to sit on them. I'm not going to pull them out. Yeah, yeah, but they are not working to bridge. They have a guy in the front group. It is not in their best interest to bridge. Yeah, but it's three of them against one of them, so three at any time in there. Fair, but you have two other guys that you can work with. Yep. Oh, gee. Uh, do you mean to catch up, oh, gee? So you see, this is this is now where we have a tactical problem, right? The other group has caught up with you, and in that group, there are no ZCDs. Oh, shoot! I'm behind. Right behind Paul G. Okay, Sorry. sounds good. Okay, so the, I I am watching. I'm watching Daryl. He's in the front group. So, Daryl, this is now a much bigger group, so you have a sig more significant race. Uh, let me see. Paul G, you are at a position of about 31. Yes. You, are, you are about 30 seconds behind the front group. I'm right yeah. behind you. Go, stay on the step. All right. So you are you are fighting there for position number thirty one. Thirty one, really. thirty two. Yeah, thirty one, thirty two. So try to get those two. There any more power ups to the end? No. Uh, yes. Uh, no. Okay, Google. Set the temperature to 15 degrees. Well, gee, if you need to drop me, if you don't want to catch up, go ahead. Well, I'm pulling threshold, so 
Let's just keep on working together. Okay. No, there are no more power-ups. Uh, who is dropping who and why are you being dropped? Well, Paul G, is your group splitting? I don't want to talk. It's just me and him. Yeah. Oh, it's just you two? No, you yeah. work together. It's not, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. How are you together? Yeah, got it. Okay, so... There you go. So, so there is one more rider who should be with you. So there is a group behind you. Don't 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 run away from that group. Work with them. It will be a lot easier for you to to work with that group than against them. No, no. Jimmy, you are solo, solo. There is nothing around you. Um, Matt uh, and his buddy, I believe, okay. are behind you, about 30 seconds behind you. So Jeff and Matt. Oh, is Jeff with you? No, Jeff is behind. Oh. Jeff is 12 seconds behind you. And he seems to be alone-ish. No, he's in a group. Um, we'll see if they catch you. So Jeff, try to win that group. That's 42nd position. So that's, that's better than being last in that group. So, you know, try to stay with them. They are obviously not climbers. Um, you are not a climber either. So, you know. Survive. Let's see, Daryl, how are you doing? Okay, just are around. you alone? You are alone up front, right? Uh, oh, is he? Yes. Yes. Okay. So just yes. stay with that group. You're doing fine. You are at eighteen point six. So here is how it's going to play out here. At about 20.4, you are going to get a little bit of bump out of the tunnels. Then there is going to be a false flat on mixed surfaces for about 1K. I need you to stay with that front group. And then at 21.7, the KOM starts. It's 6.2K long with 400 meters elevation gain. There are breakpoints in it. I will call them out as you go. So my goal today is for you to try to score in the first 10. I will stay with you unless someone else needs help in the back. Good, Daryl. Uh, at the moment, Marco, I do have a feather. Uh, so. Stay with it. There are no more power ups, so stay with the yeah. feather. Keep it until. Um, so use it when you think that you will need it the most. I'm not going to give you guidance on that. You will know best. For me, sometimes it works best on 5%. Sometimes it's I need help at 10 I personally find that it gives me more speed on slightly lower inclines than on, on a really steep thing, but entirely up to you. Hazy, hipster, engaged, whatever that means. All right, 19.8, you are getting close. It's at 21.7, so it's 2K to go. The easy pace at the moment. Right, but it is going to kick up a little bit on the way out of the tunnels. And it is relatively easy pace up front, I have to say. Yes. 
Alright, watch for that kick now. So there is a little bit of a movement from the back, I need you to follow that. Yeah, that guy with the uh, with alien wear shirt. Good work, good work. So stay with them, stay with them. Now try to not push out in front. I don't want you in front. So this is where the mixed terrain is now. A little bit more effort. Twenty point nine you have at twenty one point seven, so about eight hundred meters to go, seven hundred meters to go to the climb. It's going to kick up a little bit over the bridge, but not much. It's going to go to about 3%, if I'm not much mistaken. But stay with the front group, stay with the front group. I love the comments. Hey, Jimmy, group of three is coming up behind you. So, Jimmy, be you ready to work with them? Uh, you want to stay in the group? Don't be dropped by the group. And you two have the job to actually win your group, whatever that group may be. And Daryl, you are approaching the climb. You should be seeing the marker in about 100 meters. So if you're going for the FTS, get some speed now. <laughs> All right. So there is a movement from ATP. He's going, so follow. Good luck. So you're going to have your first rest point at about 22.2. So try to push hard. That rest is coming. It's in 300 meters. Push it, push it, push it, push it, push it. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. You don't have to win, but don't be dropped by that front splint. Follow the CLS guy, follow the CLS guy. Good job, good job. Follow the fake ZCD. Outstanding, outstanding. You can do it. The rest is coming. It's at 22.2. Here it is. Here it is. Try to push through. Try to push through here. And then change the gear now. Start changing the gears. It's going to flatten out. It's not going to be flat, but it's going to be restful. So put, put in some effort. Get some speed going. The next rest you are going to get at 22.4. So put in, put in some effort here. Some effort, some effort. Okay, okay, this is going to pitch up now. Push, 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 push. I need you to be in the top 10 here. All right, here comes the rest. Here comes the rest. This is it. This is a little bit of a flat section. Now get some speed, get some speed. Regroup with the front. Push it hard, push it hard, push it hard. It's going to pitch up now. The next one is at 22.4 or 9. At 9. Just here, as it turns and goes over the bridge, there will be a little bit rest. So push in some effort. Put in some effort. You're number 14. I need you to bridge that little gap. 
unless you want an espresso. I know that you don't want an espresso. You're not that kind of a person. Bridge that gap. Bridge that gap. All right. Nice. This is now easy 4%, easy 4%, 3%. You see, it's flattening out. Change the gears. Put in some effort. Follow the guy. Follow the fake ZCD. He will lead you through to the next group. There is a wasp coming out behind you. Follow him. So this is mostly flat up until 23K. So keep pushing. You don't want to be dropped here. This is a false flat, only 3%. You can do this in a big in a big wheel. Big chain ring. This is a false flat, but you can do it. You, you have time to catch up with the front group, but you need to do it on the flat. All right, get ready to work. The next rest is at 23.7, so 1K from now. So if you have power, try to catch that front group. All right, here we go. This is the time to use your feather. and try to bridge. Now go to that front group. There is a group of three riders coming up behind you. You are number 15. This is now race for 15. You will have rest at 23.7. Try to follow these. I'm not going to contest with any of these guys right now. Okay. But try to contest oh, 15. Focus on, yeah, focus on the other folks. They got more, more point differential than me. Okay. Uh, I can do that. Hello, and Paul, I'm going to try to catch up with you. I'm going to wrap it. I got it. I see you there. Shalom, shalom. You are at 23K. <laughs> so... You are now out of the rest. Does any one of you have a feather? Negative. You will have next rest at 23.7. So you are about 500 meters from the next flat zone. So put in some effort. This is not that far. Good effort, good effort, good effort. Paul, try to follow Shalom. Very good. You don't have to lead that group. Stay with them. You still have some ways to go. Paul, I need you to follow that. All right, 23.4. You have 300 more meters and then it's a little bit flat for 200 meters. So just survive through here. This is good. This is good. Good effort. Solid effort. Yeah. 
Shalom, I don't need you to lead this. Um, you are dropping Paul, so ma make sure that you let them lead. Let them set the pace. You just need to uh, preserve, conserve your energy to follow their attacks, but don't lead them on the attack. So this is where it's going to pitch down. So Paul, I need you to catch up, and Shalom, you need to follow this. You yeah. need to catch up with those front. Oh, okay, outstanding. Let let Paul lead because he's a bit heavier. This is super tackable, so get some speed, get some speed, get speed going. Use the momentum to go through that climb. Outstanding work, boys. Outstanding work. Alrighty. Nice work. The next rest is at 24.5, so it's close. It's not that far, but this is going to get hard at 10, 11%. But good job using the momentum there. Guys, yeah, they're far behind me. So, five hundred more meters to go, and there will be a little bit of respite. Don't lead, don't lead, don't lead, Paul. Let them leave. Don't set the pace. Don't set the pace. Let them burn the matches. You just follow. Conserve energy to be able to follow. Okay. Now, this is where you use the energy. So follow, follow the guy in yellow and black. Shalom, try to bridge that. Don't let them pull out. Don't let them pull away. There will be a descent on which they can drop you. So need need more effort from both of you. About 15 more percent of effort. Just enough so that you are not dropped. Keep the pressure on them. Let them work harder than you. Paul, a little more. Try to catch up with Shalom if you can. You're at 24.3, at 24.5, you will get some. But for, for that to be effective, you need to be in the group. It's not much rest. It's going to be just a false flat, but enough for you to change the gears. Good job, good job. Now try, so the two of them are trying to bridge to the Alienware guy, Tron. So try to make up that distance with them. So here it's imperative that you start spinning now. It is going to be a little flat, curve to the left, and then it's going to pitch up again. But you need to get some speed going to use that momentum. This is it. Well done, Paul. This is it. This is what I'm talking about. Shalom, follow, follow, follow. Try to get as much speed as you can here to use that momentum to go up. Well done, Paul. All right, so this is going to be a tough one. The next rest is at 25.5, so you have a full kilometer to go with the next rest. Well done, Shalom. Well done. Keep going, keep going, keep going. You see how you approached him, you got close to him, and now he's picking up the pace. This is what you want. You put the pressure on him for him to work and not you, but you need to follow that. So you see, he's trying to bridge that gap, so follow it through, follow it through. He's doing the work for you now. It's free energy for you. It's coming out of thin air. Feel free. I know. <laughs> 
Paul, try to not be dropped there. Shalom, if you can, try to bridge to that blue tron. Okay. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. Just follow the uh, just follow the cruise bike guy. Good job, Sean. Yep, you're doing great. Good job, Paul. Good job, Paul. Shalom tried to follow him. There are two guys approaching. I need you to not be beaten by them. This ends at 27.9. You will have rest at 25.5, so try to catch up with that guy in front of you. Shalom, I need you to try to catch up to Paul if you can. Paul, you're doing great. This is fantastic effort. You're getting to the rest point, but it would be ideal if you can catch those two guys before the rest point. Well, flat point, I'm calling it rest is stretch of imagination. Shalom, you're doing great. You're doing great. You're you're pulling away from great. All right, Shalom, you're doing great. But Paul, tr now I need you to give me everything you have. Now you must catch them. This is it. This is it. Pull, pull, push, 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 push. Full power. Full power. Full power. Full power. Full power. Don't go into super tuck yet. Full power. Give me full power. Give me full power. All right, super tuck. You need to rest a little bit. You need to rest. All right. Now, full power. Full power now. Full power now. Full power. You have used your momentum much better than they have. And you have caught up with them. So this is outstanding work. Everything that they have done on the previous climb doesn't count. You have undone all of it. And you are now in the race for 38th position. So keep going. Right the on. next rest for you is 26.6. Show them how are you doing? Let me see. Oh, you, you made it too. Outstanding. If you can bridge it um, before that 26.6 mark, I think that you're going to do great here. Paul, don't work harder than you have to. Just stay with them. We will uh, we will escape them at the next escape. Shalom, try to work with those guys that are catching up with you and try to bridge this gap. They are pulling away, but you can still make it. Paul, you're doing great. Just stay with the yellow guy. Tron is out of the race. I want to say he's still dangerous, but I think that he is out of it. But yellow guy isn't, so I need you to, to work harder to, to catch him. This is 10%. I know it's hard. 
it's going to get harder yet. Okay, it's going to get a lot, lot more easier at about 27.9. <laughs> Good job, Paul. Good job, Paul. The Tron is catching up with you and he's moving at a faster speed. Remember, at 26.6, you are going to get a little bit. I can't tell you what it is because I can't remember, but it is going to be about 100 meters of some sort of rest. It's going to be a descent. I can see it from here. So try to catch with the yellow guy. Try to catch with the yellow guy. Now is the time. Use, use your power. Use your power. Stay with him. You don't have to go ahead of him. Not yet. But this is it. This is it. Where I need you to start pushing the putting the hard effort in. Do it now. Do it now. Keep going. Keep going. And I need you to follow through now. Now give me full power. Give me everything you have. That's it. Use the momentum. Use the momentum. Full speed. Well done. Well done. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. This is it. This is it. This is it. Give it. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Use your speed. Use your power. Now power through this. The next rest that you will have is at 27.5 where it gets completely flat to the end. So it's 400 meters flat at the end. That's at 27.5. You're almost there. Daryl, you are position 28. How are you holding up? I can get up. <laughs> Try to hold You're the almost there, right? Yeah. Okay. Paul, you have 900 meters to go. Get up, Paul. Paul. Oh. <laughs> Good effort. Shalom, how are you doing? I'm going to take that as unable to speak, which is okay. Well done, Paul. So if you cross that guy, you will be 30 seconds. 31st there, so this is where the points are. So if you can beat that guy, that would be great. Now, at the top of this hill, at 27 and a half, it gets flat. I know you have power for flat, so plan to work. Because you're obviously relaxing now.
But well done, well done, staying ahead of that guy, well done. No, a little bit more effort. At the sign, be ready to change gears, because this is where it flattens out. I need you to do big chain ring and start pushing like a sprint. Don't go at sprint power, even though you probably don't have it right now, but this is it. This is where it flattens out, so change the gears and keep going. You, you can see the finish line. Now go, go after this guy. This is it, this is it. Go after him, go after him. He's not expecting it right now. You can still beat him, he's far out. He's almost through. Get a paw, get a paw. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. You can't beat that guy, but I need you to beat that Tron dude. All right, this is it. Well done. Um, uh, standing work. Oh, uh, Shalom, let's see how you're doing. Hey, shalom. All right, Shalom, uh, try to beat that guy. Hard, hard, hard work, hard work, hard work. I don't know where the breakpoints are, but I need you to be 38 and not... Come on. Shalom. Got it, buddy. Well done. All right, Jimmy, you're next. You are all okay. alone. You are you're at 27.2. There is a guy ahead of you, there is a guy behind you, but if you continue at this pace, I think you're going to do fine, you're 44th, so there are points on the line um, at 45, so I need you to, well, not be beaten by the guy behind you, who is catching up, he is 14 seconds behind, but it is going to flatten out, so I need you to leave something in the tank for those last 500 or so meters. And the two other guys who are... Start. Go ahead. <sighs> All right, Jimmy, so you are coming up to the sign. At this <laughs> sign, take a breather or two, get ready to change the gears, and at the second sign, I need you to start working. The other guy is catching up, so there is a sign number one that you're coming up to now. Get ready to change your gears. Now, slowly take a few, few easy spins, one, two, take a breather, change gears into a big chain ring, and go. This is where I need you to start going. Go, go, go. That's it. That's it. That's it. Keep going. Keep going. Come on, Jimmy. You have you have gotten your distance. They are still not up over that little crest. Where are they? Oh, weird. All right. You can take it easy now. You have gotten your position there. Well done. All right, Jeff. Now let's see about you. So you are in the position of unknown out of 57. 52nd out of 57. That's okay. Wait, I'm missing one of you. Matt, where are you? Did you finish? Done. Oh, I didn't see I you finish. Okay. He's behind Paul and just ahead of uh, Shalom. Uh, oh, really? I didn't see that. Oh, when did you pass them? Uh, uh, it was, that was a brutal that. KOM. They were, were nice rabbits, helping to be honest. Yeah, yeah I try to keep it here, but uh, I don't have anything left. All right, Jeff, but here, uh, Jeff, here's the thing. So there are no points on the line here. Um, whether you beat this dude or not, so just work with him. Um, the other guy is minute and 20 seconds behind you, and the last dude is 2 minutes and 19 seconds behind that. 
So you have gotten your FAL points through the sprint. So this was your biggest contribution. So just finish the race, you know, don't get beaten by the guy who is minute and a half behind you. And this is good. So you have 900 meters to go. Oh, yeah. How's everyone feeling? I'm feeling great. Are you right? Yeah. I'm not, I'm not racing. Oh, not racing. Uh, no, not today, no. Uh, that's a that's a smart. I wonder he's in such a good mood. Yeah. <laughs> it's about time to crack I open traded, the beer. I traded. I traded this race for the TTT. So you know, those of you who uh, have raced with me before, you know how much I love TTTs. So <laughs> that was an actual sacrifice for me. Yeah, <laughs> absolute favorite. I know. Hey, it's my absolute favorite. <laughs> now, we all get to sit out one, and I figured that having a climber like Corey today uh, for us would be better option than having an essentially a puncher sprinter um, trying to climb a KOM. So. Yeah. Uh, super nice work, guys, up that last climb. I'm pretty sure it, that each and every one of you put time into put time into me on that. I was uh, <laughs> towards the end of that. I was like, "Oh, I saw you guys sneaking up on me." Yeah. No, I tell you, uh, I uh, it would have been good for me to have pre-written this because I thought. Uh, I mean. I've ridden that epic reverse a ton of times when I was on my way to Tron. However, I forgot that the actual start of the KOM is not included when you you turn on Road to Sky because you have that entire climb up past the bridge, which I was not accounting for in my mental brain of what a what effort was going to be involved. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that first pitch, that first pitch I was trying to stay with the front group and I was tracking my power, and it was three minutes at like 350 watts, and it, and it was just like <laughs> that is not going to be any system, not sustainable. So you just do a sign of the cross and put it in a put it in the good Lord's hands. Yep. Holy buckets! Well, feeling good. Uh, Marco, you saw that I am not going to be uh, DSing for you all tonight. Yes, I will be DSing, so we're all good. Oh. 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 All right, man. Well, I do have to get going. I have to get cleaned up and uh, have a belated Valentine's Day with the, the spouse. So we'll bid you all adieu. Good race, good man. Good this is a blast. Good race. See you, man. It's great race and Jeff is, and Jeff is just about to finish anyway. He is at the that first sign at the the crest thing. Nice. Way to go, Jeff. Nice work, Jeff. And you got the FAL points on the sprint, so that's great. Yeah, I mean, I think when we look at the point total at the end, you're probably going to have that biggest the biggest contribution. Uh. Those sprint points help a lot. <laughs> oh yes, and the uh, and even though I was very happy with my effort up that climb in the middle, doesn't get you that many points in tenth. <laughs> well, I mean, when I say Jeff got the FAL points, he was tenth, but it's still points. <laughs> Ten, no, no, I'm lying. Sorry, I got, I got it was better. fourth or fifth. Yeah, yeah fourth or fifth. I, I apologize. Yeah, fourth or fourth or fifth. And well done, Jeff. Serious points. Yeah, yeah, those were serious points indeed.
So on that note, I'm going to end the stream. Have a great day and see you in an hour with the crushers. Well, I mean, I'm still here. I just ended the stream.